Hi everybody, I'm David, one of your experts here at the Baby Doc Shop, and today I'm reviewing the single to double, double Cybex Gazelle. Now, for your convenience, I've divided this video into chapters so you can access the nuggets that you need that little bit faster. But before I get stuck in, can I just say that if you do find this review helpful, please show your support by liking, by commenting, and by sharing with your friends. Here at the Baby Doc Shop, we are fanatical about all things baby and we just love helping people find a buggy that matches their lifestyle. If you do want to get in contact with us, or perhaps you maybe want to book an appointment, either in store or virtually, I've included all of our contact details in the description below. So, without further ado, let's get stuck into the review of the Gazelle. So the Cybex Gazelle has really grown in popularity the last couple of years. It offers excellent functionality, it's super user friendly, and it really is brilliant value for money. So first up, what I'll say is it's a single to double. That means it can operate as either a single seat buggy, like you see it now, or you can add a second seat unit onto the chassis, or you can have a combination of seat units, carry cots, and car seats. That's what makes it very popular amongst first time parents, because if another baby does arrive within a couple of years, you won't need to swap out the buggy. Now, let's have a look, a closer look at the buggy itself. So first up, what you'll notice is really durable fabrics, it comes in a variety of colors and the chassis can come in either black or taupe. Now, I prefer the taupe because the handlebar with the taupe version is leatherette, whereas with the black, it is foam. The hood itself is generous in size and it is extendable like so, giving full sun coverage. And there's a really nice little peekaboo window here at the top, allowing you to see into baby, as well as promoting air circulation. The handlebar is telescopic and extendable to a nice big tall size. And at the back here, there's a one-handed recline into the lie flat position. The seat unit itself is quite large. So let me show you that. First thing you'll notice is that it's really well padded. Everything is durable, easy to wipe clean. The recline function is quite interesting because it actually slides the seat element, making it that little bit more comfortable for baby and giving you a true lie flat position. And there's an adjustable footrest here at the bottom. So the Cybex Gazelle is a true multi-terrain buggy. Uh, it has big puncture-free tires mounted on this really sleek chassis supported by this super soft, nice bouncy suspension. So this is at home in any sort of environment, city, suburban, rural, and it will handle that little bit of off-road or trekking across a football pitch. Underneath, you'll see a really generous sized shopping basket with high net sides, meaning you can just fire in your baby bits without the fear of them actually falling out, uh, making it a very practical walking buggy. Now let's move on to the fold. The fold for me is one of the most important things about a buggy. And when you are buying a buggy, you need to think about how easy is it to fold and where am I gonna store it when it is folded? So with the Cybex Gazelle, it folds as a one piece. That means you don't have to remove the seat unit before you go to fold it. Let me show you how that works. To fold it, you press the button at the back here and collapse the seat unit like so. And then there are two white buttons and it's just one move from here. And it will lock on the left once folded. Um, there's a little carry handle here allowing you to carry the buggy. Now I will be honest, it's heavy, but it's supposed to be because it's got to carry two 22 kilo toddlers plus a toddler board at the back. So what do you expect? To reopen it, you pop the latch on the left side here. You open it like so and refold the seat. Simple. That will give me a chance to show you the carry cot. So to remove the seat unit, there are two buttons on either side. You pop off the seat like so. Let's do the old switcheroo. Hopefully that balances, but if it doesn't. And the carry cot pops on like so. And the carry cot, really simple in design but really nice looking, I have to say. Peekaboo window, a mesh vent. Again, all the fabrics are yeah, quite, 
quite durable, semi-stain resistant. Everything you see is removable and machine washable. And the carry cot itself is approved for occasional sleeping. What I like about the Gazelle is there is a memory, memory button release for the carry cot. So to remove it from the chassis, you press a white button here and a white button here and has a nice little carry handle that you lift up and walk away. That gives me the opportunity to show you some of the really, really user-friendly aspects of this buggy. So first up, your adapters are built into the chassis. So to configure it in different methods, you just press a button and slide them up and slide them down. This is handy, the carry cut mode, because it allows you to put it in a slightly elevated position, shortening the gap between you and your newborn. And after all, newborns are short-sighted. What I like, and hopefully we can show you a close-up of, is that all of the configuration constructions are included in the base of the shopping basket. So when you are suffering with baby brain, you don't have to try and remember anything. It's all printed there for you. Out of the box, it includes a nice little feature here. I twist these adapters around. I pop my seat unit out front, like so. And I get this handy little shopping basket that I can pop in up here, giving me some space for my extra bits. Quite cool. It's a clever use of space, you know, I, I think. Who knows how much you'd actually use it, but it's still, you know, it's clever. You can also, out of the box, configure it with the carry cot, like so. One second, and now this pops in here, and this pops in like so. Again, straight out of the box. Now the buggy itself is compatible with car seats. You can buy adapters or you get adapters with it that'll be make it compatible with the likes of Cybex, Maxi Cozy, etc. Making this a travel system buggy too. So let's get on to the conclusion. Okay, so in summary, the Cybex Gazelle, it is really functional, it is really durable, and it is really user-friendly. And guess what else it really is? It really is excellent value for money. And I think that's one of the things that's making it so popular now amongst first-time parents. Um, if you were to push me for negatives on this, I suppose the fold, even though it's really compact, it is kind of heavy to lift it, even with the carry handle on the seat, but look, what do you expect? It's, it's a single to double buggy. And on that point, this buggy, when you add on the second seat, there is no weight restriction on that second seat. It can hold two 22 kilo toddlers. So look, it needs to be sturdy. The only other thing I'd say kind of watch out for is that, again, I pointed out at the start of the, the, the video, that if you do go for black, the black comes with a foam handle instead of a leatherette handle. And personally, being the princess that I am, I prefer the, the leather handles. They just are that little bit more comfortable. So in summary, it really is a, a fantastic single to double option and one that we would recommend. Uh, so look, that concludes my review of the Cybex Gazelle. Now, if you did find this video helpful, please, please, please show your support by liking, by commenting, and by sharing with your friends. Uh, here at the Baby Doc Shop, we are just fanatical about helping you find a buggy that matches your lifestyle. And if you'd like to get in contact, or perhaps you'd like to book an appointment, uh, either in store or virtually online, you can do so by going to the contact details that I have uh, included in the description below. I'm David, one of your buggy experts here at the Baby Doc Shop. Thank you very much for watching, and hopefully see you soon.